if we're a better team tonight, but that doesn't break our bond as, as a brotherhood. As far as them being able to be so successful with the run, how much would Nas Jones have showed up the defensive line? I mean, of course, Nas Jones would have been a big help. But he said the same thing about Aaron Crawford and all the other D linemen that we lost this year. Um, we were, we were, we always been injury, injury, like we were struck by injury. So uh, that was a big thing for us. But uh, I feel like Nas would have been a big help. You guys gave up about 1,400 yards in the last two games to elite, high-level offenses. Despite all the improvements this year, how, what does that tell you how far away you guys are from where you need to be? Um, it just shows that we still got some work to do. I mean, I feel like we made some great strides coming from last year, but it shows that we still got some work to do for next year. So we're just going to uh, work on getting our gap fits and everything right in the springtime so we'll be better next year. Is the barometer now teams like that? Because you know that the middling teams you guys are okay with, yeah. so now that's the barometer that raises everything? Focus on teams that like them high-powered offenses. Uh, a lot of teams that have tempo and just stuff like that, that's what we're going to focus on a lot now. Then. We want to talk about, uh, obviously it's the last game for guys like Justin Thomason, and just, just talk about you know uh, what they've meant to this program and, and to you guys. That would be missed. I mean, they, they, were, they were great competitors. Jeff, guys like Jeff Schottner, Marquise, uh, Junior Nankande, Justin Thomason, all those guys, that would be missed. Uh, I mean, it's going to be hard to fill their role, but I feel like a lot of our younger guys are going to step up and they're going to get the job done. What is it?